So what's a taxonomy? It's a hard term to describe because it's used so much. Um, on the one hand, it's good that we have a word that describes the kinds of stuff that we do. On the other hand, it's a pretty vague word and it actually really has very little meaning uh, in practice. The word taxonomy originally came from uh, biological studies where people created a taxonomy of life forms and that was the idea of a genera, species, class, order, phylum, uh, that sort of thing. And those, uh, those distinctions were meant to clearly distinguish one organism from another hierarchically. So a taxonomy in the traditional sense is a hierarchy. It's a hierarchy that dichotomously, in other words, uniquely, defines any two organisms. Now that term has been kind of co-opted to, to be used currently to mean really anything we do having to, uh, having to do with creating um, categorization schemes. Usually it's a hierarchical categorization scheme, but I've seen things called taxonomies that are not hierarchical at all. So in practical terms, the word taxonomy is usually just a cover term to describe the kinds of things that people do when they're organizing information. So you may find job uh, listings, for example, for taxonomist. Those job listings would be for someone to come in and organize the information. Maybe it's in a hierarchical categorical scheme. Maybe it's more like a thesaurus that's a hierarchy and has cross-references between the different nodes on the hierarchy. Maybe it's just a flat list. Maybe it's just a, an index. The word that I prefer to cover the, the work that we do better because it has, no, uh, it has no historical baggage or it has less historical baggage and it also covers a much better variety of the things we do is the word controlled vocabulary.